Man United and Watford hold up peace sign for Ukraine after Rangnick's idea. Manchester United and Watford showed their support for Ukraine amid their ongoing conflict with Russia by holding up a peace sign before kick-off at Old Trafford on Saturday. The two sets of players came together to make the gesture as United boss Ralph Rangnick held up the sign to supporters and cameras. It was Rangnick's idea to use the peace sign, which included various translations of the word as well as the recognized symbol, and he was backed by his players and the club, with Watford also keen to participate in the show of solidarity. Russian troops continue to target Ukraine's cities, including its capital Kyiv, with air and missile strikes and the country's health minister has confirmed almost 200 people have already been killed and more than 1,000 wounded in the tragic scenes. Rangnick lived in Moscow for six months in his previous role at Lokomotiv Moscow prior to moving to United back in November. Speaking about the conflict earlier this week, Rangnick said, the situation is desperately sad. I think everybody will think similarly about that, it's just an incredible situation, that we have a kind of war in Europe. And therefore, the decision UEFA took to strip Russia of the Champions League final was inevitable, and it was the right decision. I think everybody has the same opinion about what's happening there. This is just a human disaster, what is happening there for all the people involved. Right now, as far as I can tell, the situation in Russia, and in Moscow, is still safe, but this doesn't change anything about the whole situation, which is desperately sad. When I still watch TV in the morning, and the evening I still cannot believe what I see there. This is just a terrible situation and I very very much hope the politicians all over the world can help to de-escalate the situation and finish those kind of things that are happening there. United have already ended their Pound's 40 million sponsorship agreement with Russian-owned airline Aeroflot due to Vladimir Putin's decision to launch a full-scale invasion of Ukraine. A club spokesman said on Friday, in light of events in Ukraine, we have withdrawn Aeroflot's sponsorship rights. We share the concerns of our fans around the world and extend our sympathies to those affected. Cristiano Ronaldo has also spoken out on the conflict, writing on Instagram we need to create a better world for our children. Praying for peace in our world. As well as losing the Champions League final, which has now been moved to Paris, UEFA are in discussions over removing Gazprom as the prime sponsor of the competition. Poland's national team have also confirmed they do not intend to travel to Russia to play their World Cup playoff.